Something that I've been thinking about lately that I think might be helpful is um, have goals, but that shouldn't be your focus. When you went through that training, did you do any shooting? No. Okay. Well, when you shoot, and every team guy will know this, the saying that you hear over and over again is front tight focus. And just like when you're watching a TV show or a movie, you know, one thing's in clear focus and everything else is a little bit out of focus. Anything farther away or closer is a little bit fuzzy. If you're shooting and you really, really try to focus on the target downrange, you have a worse chance of hitting it than if you focus on the front sight of your weapon. To me, that bullseye on the target, say 25 yards downrange in a pistol range, is your goal. So what's the front sight? It's habits. If you want to get really good at public speaking, develop a habit. Develop a habit. You know, collect quotes. Collect stories. Start following really, really talented speakers online. And don't just go, wow, that was really good. What did he do? Did he, how many stories did he tell? How long were they? Did he make the audience laugh? Or was it emotionally pulling? So develop habits and make that your focus. That's your front side. So if you really want to be great at a particular subject, topic, or task, athletic endeavor, there are habits that lead to that goal. The habits need to be the focus, not the goal. That's what I think is, is uh, the simplest way to break it down. I liken, you know, just daydreaming about the goal. It's kind of like when I was in high school and I met a girl and I would be at my, at my house all by myself, just dreaming about being with this girl, but not doing anything about it. You know, it's like, well, what good is that? You know, you have to do something. And since you can't just land on the goal, work at it and, and develop a habit.